yes, this is going to be a tough one for Laker fans, especially tonight, and then obviously moving forward throughout the NBA playoffs. Rick Lozano was at tonight's game, and he joins us now from Staples Center with more on what is a disappointing finish for Laker fans this season. Yeah, absolutely, Mark. Uh, a lot of despondent fans exiting Staples Center at the moment. This has got to be a, a gut punch for the Lakers and their fans. Here's a team won the championship last year, favored to do it all over again this year, but you can never figure injuries during the course of a season that really was a big bugaboo for the Lakers. Let's take a look down uh, at Staples Center and you can see all those sad fans exiting the building after the uh, Phoenix Suns finish off the Lakers in the first round of the playoffs 113 to 100. And this was just a case of the Lakers falling too far behind so early and then just not having enough to come all the way back. As Mark mentioned, Anthony Davis was in the lineup to start the game, but he lasted only five minutes, had to come out with that leg injury never went back in. In the meantime, the Suns have this youngster by the name of Devin Booker. He outscored the Lakers by himself in the first quarter, 22 to 14, and the Suns were up by as many as 29, and it was 62-41 at the half. Now the Lakers showed some character. They stormed back in the second half. They cut the deficit down to as few as 10 points, but in the end, they just couldn't climb all the way back. And of course, as Mark mentioned, that final 113 to 100. Booker finished with 47 points and 11 rebounds. And so the Lakers are out. Phoenix remains in the playoffs. They'll move on now to play Denver in the next round. And I can barely breathe. I'm out of breath because that was a gut punch, Mark. Guys, we'll send it back to you in the studio.